Hello, Tyrese. How are you? Hello, how are you? I'm fine. Um, thank you so much, Tyrese and the Thurgood Marshall College Fund for joining me today. First, I'd like to congratulate you on this wonderful new partnership. Um, tell us a little more details about it and what made you decide to partner up together to bring more scholarship opportunities to our African American community. I am here with my two associates that represent Thurgood Marshall. Um, and we are here to just really put a special opportunity on your radar. Um, this is a 100% black owned travel site, which is called VoltronTravel.com. And I partnered up with the Third Good Marshall Foundation to where every hotel, every flight, every car rental, and every booking in general, we will fundraise, we have been fundraising, to help put black and brown people through school, through college. Second, you know, at TMCF, we believe that, you know, you're, you know, where you're born shouldn't really determine, you know, where you go. So when you talk about um, the turtle winning the race, it's not so much about the destination, it's about the journey, right? And so, um, you know, being humble, um, operating with humility and dignity or humility with dignity um, and, and checking yourself, but also being confident enough to go with some of the messaging that will come out of this uh, partnership with, with Tyrese and Voltron Travel. Um, you know, I, I've said several times, you know, this is bigger than just the announcement of the partnership. You know, we want to impact lives and we want to change lives through the lens of travel. Uh, and explore all the opportunities and possibilities and promote that within our students. And so um, this is really, really just as an honor for us. And, and listen, Tyrese is not a small company. I mean, we, we partner with the world's largest companies. I mean, Apple, Boeing, um, I mean, you name it, Walmart, Wells Fargo, I mean, the world's largest companies. And so, you know, to that point, we can't be so big that we don't believe in, in, in other things, right, that comes to the table. And so, this is, this is a big deal for us. And uh, we share the same excitement and enthusiasm that Tyrese does because, you know, we're changing the next generation of, of future leaders. You know, we're, we're changing that landscape. We're, we're putting them in C-suite positions. We're preparing them to be globally competitive. And the funding that comes from this will go to that mission and go to that work. And so, again, it's much bigger than just, you know, a partnership with Tyrese and Voltron. This is a significant impact you know, with two passionate entities that are bringing something to the table, a powerful force. And, uh, and I'm just so excited about it and looking forward to it. Thank you so much for sharing that. And also want to say to you, Tyrese, that I appreciate you for always keeping me and the Faith, Health, and Home community on your radar in terms of sharing all of your latest projects. Um, you've been on several times before to discuss everything from your new music to movies to documentaries and I just want to appreciate you for keeping us in mind. Um, now, I know a while back you did touch upon launching a travel business um, which is VoltronTravel.com so um, tell us a little bit more about why you decided to go into the travel business, especially to um, specifically cater to the black and brown community? You know, us as, as black people, it ain't real until we see it. Like We got to see it. We got to touch it, feel, experience it. And that's when it becomes more real for us. And I remember traveling. I remember experience and baggage claim for the first time. I remember seeing license plates that didn't say California on it. I remember experiencing Times Square and could not believe all the lights on all of those buildings in Times Square. We don't have that in down in LA. I remember standing there and seeing all the yellow cabs and seeing all the people and the clutter and the energy of New York. I remember the first time I walked down the street in Times Square and I was walking like 20 miles an hour and I looked at my homie who was from LA with me and I was like, yeah, why the hell are we walking so fast? <laughs> and, and, and just kind of not noticing, like, cause LA, we, 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 you know, 
we was we was slow moving because everything is slow like Snoop Dogg. Everything is like, hey, what's going on with you, bro? Like everything is smooth and slow. You know, in New York, it's just the opposite. Um, and so I think it's very important to lead the way. And there might be some other black people that get into the dot-com track. Was successful to me. But I'm able to say I did it first. And I'm able to say that before we hit 100 million or even 75 million in profits, that I was able to partner up with a charitable organization that has a massive footprint in um, putting black and brown people through school and representing and carrying that torch where we want to be impactful now, long before we're trying to do something cool or something that looks cool in the eyes of press and PR. We did it as a early on and wanting to be impactful and make a difference. And <laughs> I'm just very honored that the Thurgood Marshall Foundation said yes to us and decided to take the journey with us. And we hope that we could raise millions and millions of dollars through this, through this program. Um, to make a difference in, in, in the world you know, and give people permission to be great. Sorry for my long answer. I'm very passionate about this stuff. Absolutely. No apologies needed. I love your passion. I love your purpose for this project. And that's why we're here to help you spread the word so that it can be a success. Um, we, we really, really want to be successful. The more successful we are, the more black and brown people we can put through school. I want to make an announcement in Jesus' name two years from now, you know, $20 million have been raised and we've shaved off. And with $20 million, the third look Marshall will be able to equate it to this is how many black and brown people we're going to be able to put through college with this much money. I want to be able to make that announcement. That's what going to college is for me. That's what the opportunity to partner up and put black and brown people through school means to me. Earlier, you guys touched upon opportunity and impact for the African-American and um, black and brown communities, actually. Um, can both of you talk about the connection that, the t that you hope will be made between emotional and spiritual health and the opportunities that your partnership will bring to the black and brown college communities. I'll let you guys chime in, Tamaria, George. Um, Tamaria, I'm gonna I'm give you give you some 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 shine here. I want I want you to, and I'll piggyback a little bit on on some thoughts. Definitely. So you know, I'll start at a TMCF believe that where you're born shouldn't determine who you become. And so when you talk about that spiritual and mental wellness in that space there, unfortunately, when you look at the statistics, there are a lot of black and brown um, young people who are not growing up in environments that allow them to be mentally well and whole. Absolutely. And so the experiences that we provide um, and ultimately the programs that we provide and the opportunity for not only a college education, but to be involved in upskilling and equity programs um, and have access to job opportunities that you never even envisioned to be possible, that is how we are investing in the wholeness, the wellness, that mental and spiritual, that holistic development. And it's because of Tyrese's vision um, from that first time he got on a plane and, and begin to see the world and how that opened his eyes that he said, let me invest in an organization that's going to do that for other young people. Yes, absolutely. And uh, that's why I asked the question because Tyrese, earlier you talked about how you felt um, seeing an airport for the first time or, or going through a baggage claim for the first time. So um, I want to know your personal thoughts on what you hope that the students that you impact through this partnership will um, take away from this partnership, both emotionally and spiritually in terms of their health and well-being. Um, 
You know, I think um, what Tamira just touched on um, was 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 the truth is it is it is the it is the actual concept of removing people from their environments. The environment in itself could kill you mentally, emotionally, spiritually, psychologically. You know, it's like, it's, it's really all in the mind. Like your brain will kill a dream and kill the things that you want to do and accomplish long before the opportunity in itself gets killed. Absolutely. People will say no and talk themselves out of magic before you even hear no. Um, so I think us partnering up and allowing people from the ghettos and the inner cities who've got all the talent and you know ambition in the world, once you get in and around environments where the dialogue and conversation changes, like people will make you feel bad about thinking about something stupid. Like what what would you just say? Come on, bro. Ain't nobody finna go spend no hundred thousand on no car, man. What are you talking about? You need to invest that money in, and you be sitting there like, what? Like, bro, you making me feel bad about wanting to go spend a hundred thousand on a Benz? Like, where where are you from, dude? Like, bro, we don't, we don't like, you know, everything changes when the environment changes. The conversation, people make you feel bad about things that somebody else may glorify. You know, like I just seen this video online. I was half asleep, but I seen this video online about them, these black men welcoming the, the, the class of 2021 to Morehouse. Yes, and I saw that. Dancing and yes. saluting. Yes. And I'm like, I was so happy to see that. And I'm gonna tell you why. Not only as a black man, I was like, yeah! right? <laughs> yes, absolutely. The thing for me is, I am exhausted with seeing black men celebrate black men for getting out of jail. Yes, absolutely. When you do college and you finish college, they'll take you to hometown buffet. Mm -hmm. You go to Red Lobster if you're lucky might be seven people there right but you get out of jail the whole hood is pulling up yeah bottles models buying you cars making you feel putting a bag on off the top you getting out of jail you got a hundred thousand right there in the bag but you go do eight years of college and you graduate with a master's and a PhD and they're going to take you to hometown buffet and pay, and pay $10.99 for all you can eat. Yeah. And so seeing, seeing the passion of the black man welcoming the black man into this place and space, it did everything for me. I didn't graduate and didn't go to college but I wanted to be in that hallway so bad. <laughs> right. You know, just like, ah, ah, ah. It did something for my soul, man. It did something for my soul, man. I felt, I was like, man, why didn't I go to college? Because I could have been in the hallway welcoming these new youngsters to school, man. Yeah. Ah. Thank you, Tyree. Right. Thank you so much for that. Yes. Thank you so much for that, all of you. And um, just, I just want to say to um, TMC of and Tyrese, coming from um, having a, a son that just graduated bachelor's and he's about to get his master's in May. I thank you for what you are doing. I thank you for all of the things that you are going to bring to our communities in order to encourage our young people. Thank you. Thank you, Faith. My pleasure. Congratulations. Thank you. Raising thank a kid. I just love that 
I love the concept of forming Voltron in order to defeat something. Um, so VoltronTravel.com partnering with the Third Good Marshall Foundation um, is, is that exact concept, which is like us, we are stronger together. The impact that we can make individually is cool, but it's even more impactful if we all align. To support scholarship funding for the black and brown college community through your travel reservations, visit VoltronTravel.com. You can also connect with Tyrese on Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter, and also visit the Thurgood Marshall College Fund at TMCF.org.